Hi, so I'm going to share two tips in this video. One is uh, on number formatting and another one is in the power play. So sometimes we have password and you know secret APIs keys and I don't want to show that on the screen but you may ask that we can see that in the formula bar. So in that case we can just you know take out this one formula bar and you will not be able to see my secret API key anyway so how can you do this that we will have has 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 and so on and that's the trick in this number format so if you look at that uh, format cell and number you'll see that um, I have one two three column and if we just don't do anything then it will be like you know blank but if you just specify that okay this number formatting will be two three and the third one is for the text and you can just specify the filling characters no 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 sorry so just look at this number format that three and then four has so that cannot use the number format type try using you know, this built in number format so you can just use four asterisks that's it um that's all so this this is the number formatting tricks and the next one is that sometimes we need to convert this to base 64 to call um, you know a rest api and i'm going to show this one in power query so you can just get the data and just drill it down so we need to function here one is that we need to convert this text into a binary form so that's why text binary and we get that as a csv file now we need you know binary to text so kind of same thing binary to text but in this section we can specify the encoding so we are just saying that uh, Bed 64 binary encoding base 64 and that's it and you'll get that you know base 64 encoded text that you can use in your rest API uh, recently I've finished one project where I have to convert a secret API you know secret API key to a base 64 and call that API power query so this is really useful thank you